Seika is a food shelf and a thrift store. We're located at 627 38th Avenue Northeast in Columbia Heights, which is right next to the city garage. We changed our model over from a clothing room to the thrift store so that we could give the clients a little more dignity. Now we're selling things at garage sale prices. If clients can't afford it because there's some who just really can't afford even those kind of prices, we're giving them a, a voucher so that they can shop. But we're really asking people to you know, buy if they can because what we're going to do with the money then that we make it's going to be turned around and we'll be purchasing food with it, and, you know, that sort of thing. Maybe fix a truck if it needs it. Uh, it's expensive renting a food shelf. And we're looking for things that are in, a, in decent condition, kind of the gently used condition. Anybody can come in and shop. This is our food room that we're in here right now. It's got all the different canned and, you know, groceries, soaps and paper products and stuff. We changed our whole food model around recently. The way we used to do it was people would come in and we'd have food prepackaged for them. That worked out great in a lot of ways. I mean, they, they got a lot of food. We've always been very generous with the food here. Now what we're doing is we have client choice. We have a shopper that helps them out, lets them know how much food they can take of the different, different types of food. They escort them through and, and away they go. One really nice thing about that though too is we're getting a lot more interaction between the clients and the volunteers. We use a lot of volunteers for a lot of different things. Uh, there's warehouse help, uh, there's intake where the clients are checking in. We have cashiers, we have people straightening up the thrift store, we have people that sort out the uh, clothes and the household items. We want to make sure we get good quality things out. Seika would not be here if it wasn't for the volunteers. I have to really give a tremendous amount of uh, thanks to the volunteers. We have a really small staff here. People can contribute to Seika in many different ways. Uh, a lot of people come in with food, and different times of the year we get different things. You know, in the fall, late summer and into the fall, it's really nice. We get a lot of produce from uh, different people. We have a community garden. Uh, it's food drives. The Columbia Heights Boy Scouts and Girl Scouts came in recently, and they brought in about 1,600 pounds of food. And so that was really nice. People can help donate too by coming to our fundraisers. Fundraisers are great, they're community events. It's a community thing. SAKE is really all about the community and helping it out, and it all adds up. What's really nice about the food donations is it brings in a lot of different things because when I'm buying food uh, from the food banks, we're buying things in bulk because of how we can buy through the food banks. Uh, our dollar goes a whole lot farther. SECA really is a community organization. That's what we're here for, is to help those who are less fortunate, and we want them to feel welcome, and we're here to help.